I am Katana. Nice to see you again, Patty. Hi, Katana. So great to see you again. You're looking amazing. Hi, everyone, and welcome back. Just a quick note on our channel. We are here for educational purposes only. We do not intend to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease or medical condition. Always consult with a physician or other qualified health care providers before embarking on a new treatment, product to use, diet, or fitness plan. Hey, Katana, who do we have here today? We would like to welcome... Welcome a beautiful and very talented Miss Sheila Hay. A very warm welcome to Miss Sheila Hay. Well, I'd just like to say thank you to you two beautiful ladies and um, for inviting me here today. It's an honor and a privilege to get to be on your call. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure having you here with us. We have been watching you helping so many people with this groundbreaking technology that activates stem cells and so much more. Miss Sheila, how did you start with this? Well, my story actually um, starts back in 2018 when I had my fourth knee surgery and uh, I have zero ACL and they removed the final bit of cartilage. There's no scar tissue, and it was just bone on bone. And um, because I'm allergic to all opioids, I spent six weeks on an ice machine, 24 hours a day um, to alleviate the pain. It would be cycling 20 minutes on, 20 minutes off. And um, when I was finally able to get up and walk, I had to learn how to walk again, and I was using a cane. And in, that was up in Alaska. And then in 2019, in May, I ended up moving here to Maui and um, met my best friend here. Um, she moved a week after I arrived. And Kathleen in 2019 gave me a patch. And she, um, she said, normally we put the patch back here, but you put it on your point of pain. And the doctors, the surgeons had told me that I would have pain for the rest of my life down at the inside under my knee. And so it was truth. I'd cried for two day, two years solid every day. I cried and um, I put that patch on the X39 and three hours after I put the patch on for the first time, I could kind of just go like that on my knee without excruciating pain. And I started crying again because uh, every day I'd been asking God for a miracle that would just just be enough miracle to take away pain. I, I wasn't asking, you know, make me have more cartilage or give me a new ACL. I just wanted some pain relief to go from a 10, maybe down to a six or a seven or even a five if I was lucky. And um, fast forward six weeks after using the patch, I quit walking with a cane. And um, my pain level just continued to decrease. I went to the LifeWave convention in January of 2020, and I met Marcy and Peter. And one of my favorite things that, and Marcy, we laugh about it all the time, is that uh, we danced. And it was the first time for three years that I was able to dance. Mm -hmm. And I actually left my cell phone in one of the convention rooms. And I said, oh my God, Marcy, I gotta go get my phone. And when I came back, I realized I'd ran because I was afraid somebody would take my phone. And I said, Marcy, Marcy, I ran. And she couldn't believe it either. So it's kind of the beginning of my journey. That was three and a half years ago. Uh, I learned how to play golf in 2021. So I golf one day a week. Um, I like to go to the gym and work out. And my life has totally been changed. Amazing. That's amazing. And wow. This is something that you are helping people to uh, learn about this technology as well, right? That is correct. We, um, Jan and I, a friend of mine, Jan, we have a call on Friday mornings and we like to train people um, beyond normal, normal business training and just what about this, you know, what this patch is. And on Tuesday afternoons, Kathleen and I, uh, are part of our teams, uh, what we call the Patching Podcast. We uh, do those five days a week. 
and we bring on wonderful people like you that share their stories about how LifeWave has changed their life as well. And it's definitely that changing awesome. the world, right? It's changing the world. We're finally finding out that we have light in the body and we're sharing this information, right? That is correct because, you know, so many of us, um, we go through our day and, and we're taught, you know, I'm, I'll be 60 in October. And wow. I remember back when I was a kid in science, we were told that there were five separate systems in the body and that they didn't integrate and that they were total complete. <laughs> look on your face. Yeah. Like, wow. So we had your skeletal system, you had your cardiovascular system and they didn't mesh. And, you know, uh, thankfully, science has grown up and as I've grown up and um, we all are electrical beings, okay, every single one of us. And we operate at frequencies, which are electrical frequencies, and that is what light is as well. And so we do all have a light body. And what this tiny little patch is literally doing is raising your light frequency. It is. I like it because you can put it on for 12 hours and go off and do whatever you need to do. You're not stuck in a space doing light therapy. And you know that the changes are happening because you feel them, you see it. I mean, you don't look your age at all. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm going to ask you, will you ever take this off? Will you uh, ever stop? No, I won't stop using the patches. And people say to me, uh, I've had people say, well, do you, what do you mean? You're going to wear this for the rest of your life? And my question, I, I, throw a question at them and I say, are you going to take those supplements for the rest of your life? Okay. Are you going to take your vitamin C or your vitamin A or your vitamin D? And when they answer in the affirmative, I say, well, why is this any different? Very the true. difference is that when I put this patch on myself, my body heat is activating it and it's activating, you know, my light body is then being reflected literally back into my own body, the patch that it's, it's like a little mirror. Oops. Sorry about that. A little wind over there. <laughs> um, the um, it's like a mirror and it reflects specific light frequencies back into your skin that then travel to your brain to start you to produce that copper peptide. And that is the master molecule of our system. And, um, so many of us have uh, depleted our uh, mineral systems in our bodies. And, um, you know, that's one of the things I take daily also is copper. And I was recently um, directed by a physician to not just take 2.5 milligrams, but I need to go up to five milligrams of copper a day. Mm -hmm. And um, I think that that's a big issue and concern for a lot of people because copper is what our body needs to function so that the GHK copper peptide can do its job and help us to create more stem cells. So um, it's all a big circle, kind of like our patch, right? I also found out that mm -hmm. copper helps take the inflammation out of the body. And it's a great, if somebody has varicose veins, like for me, I have these spider veins. And I started taking copper about three months ago, but I was only taking 2.5 milligrams. Now I bumped it up to four milligrams of copper. And I'm noticing that my spider veins are actually diminishing. I'm just looking down at mine now because I'm like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I hadn't even thought about that, but yes. Yeah, hey, I'll share something and I, maybe this is not the right time, but um, my daughter my turned, my daughter turned 37 yesterday. So uh, I have 37 year old stretch marks. Okay. And this morning I got out of the shower and I realized my stretch marks are smoother than they have ever been and, and faded. And I'm like, wow, I'm looking at my little belly thinking, 
Man. Who doesn't want this, right? Come on. Who doesn't want to put a sticker on their body and have all, look at Katana. She's got them. I have them here because this is. Mine's back behind my neck from right behind my my hair. Yeah. (laughs) I do have one under my belly button. That that makes me think because, you know, every morning I get up and I look in the mirror as I'm going to the restroom and I never even thought about the whole stretch marks because I had them down here and I don't see them. They're not prominent. And I never even realized I'm that in the, that while you were saying blue, that, it was, you know, did you, were, were they like that kind of that purpley reddish blue color, some of it, parts of it. And that's what made like me a, today. Out <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And that was what caught my attention today was like, wow, that that's different. And, and um, so, you know, here we are three and a half years since my first patch and I am still seeing new, um, new changes. Mm-hmm. I, I was uh, last week had my teeth cleaned, and for the first time since I, I was a teenager, I heard when they're doing the dentist or the um, the hygienist is poking your checking your little pockets. You know, I've had six, seven, eight pockets for years, mm. and I cannot tell you. She kept saying two, three. Three, two, two. And I'm like, what's going on now? There's still a couple where the big stuff was that it's working. But down here and over here, the pockets have decreased. I don't know anything. Okay. Like I said, I'm almost 60. I've had all those pockets for years and years. All of a sudden they're leaving. The only thing different in my life is the patches and taking copper. That's it. So Beautiful. something's changing. Yeah, we, we're using it. So that's <laughs> why we're talking about it. And that's why we're creating this channel so we can connect with people that are using this technology so we can show them that, yeah, it's working, period. How, Sheila, how do you see this technology um, in a global spectrum? You know, how do you see this spreading within 10 years? 20 years, 40 years, how, how fast do you think this is going to be spreading? Okay. So I know that from just in the three years that I've um, utilized patches, our growth has been exponential. And, um, you know, a lot of the people that um, are on the patches today are light workers and uh, like both you ladies and myself, and I, I know that our mission is to get out and help everybody that we can raise their frequency. And I'll tell you what, this has got to be the quickest way that I know to help somebody. I mean, I have put people on massage tables for years, helping shift their bodies, doing different therapies. Um, but this works faster. And so for me, you know, Ideally, 10 years, I would like to see it all around the planet. Is that realistic? I don't know. Maybe if enough of us manifest that, then we can have that. But it's a we pretty amazing, be right? We can, if we all come together um, and have put that same thought out into the container, maybe that's what can happen because we know how swiftly collective consciousness changes. Just look at look at what's happened over our world over the last three years alone, planet wide. So, if that's a three year cycle, hey man, ten years doesn't sound so unrealistic, does it? Not at all. I'm hoping <laughs> that. I believe if we all come together and and like you said, bring that energy to that spot of knowing in ten years that life wave will be all over the world it will happen exactly we're already in 81 countries i don't know how many countries are on the planet anymore because they keep changing you know different um one country turns into another which turns into three etc etc but to me we're in 81 countries we've got to be at least in half the countries on the planet or pretty darn close to them. And um, it's just going to continue and continue and continue. The, the big thing is that 
we're here to help wake people up to the fact that your body um, has energetically and innate intelligence to heal itself. And it is done with frequency. And the more that we can um, share this technology of, of light therapy, the, the quicker we can get it out there, more people can live lives that are actually um, fulfilling for them. You know, so many people are in this like doldrum, you know, you do the same thing day after day, you go to the office, you come home, you make your dinner, you go to sleep. And it's this repetition that it, it stunts our growth. It stunts our growth emotionally, spiritually, and mentally. And I feel like the that the X39 patch, uh, one of the things that it really has done for me has been to allow myself to expand in all of those areas, not just with my physical healing, but with, um, I remember at, it was three months on the patch. Um, I turned around and looked backwards at my life. And I realized that for the last two and a half years, I had been in a major depression. And, you know, when you own a, when you own a business, uh, I had, we ran a bed and breakfast in Alaska the last six years that we lived there before we moved here to Maui four years ago. And I had 6,000 people stay at my house over that time. But the last year and a half of living there, I had this injury, this knee injury that I was waiting to get the surgery of. So I would have people come to my home and I'd put on the smile. I'd be the hostess with the mostess. And then I'd go to bed at night and cry myself to sleep because it hurt so bad. And, um, you know, it's, it's one thing when you can do that and you can fool yourself while you're fooling the other people. But when the reality comes to you that, holy goodness, I have been so depressed and now I feel joy all the time. I felt again, like I did when I was younger in my life. And mm -hmm. um, people used to call me, I was the, the head of the cheerleading squad. They used to call me Sally Rally. And um, I was always a beat and I could make a real, I can cover it up real easy. Um, when you're in pain. And I think that the majority of people do that on the planet. I think that we don't acknowledge that we're in pain. And I don't think we acknowledge that that pain causes you anger cycles and depression cycles. And um, I, I hope that whoever gets to watch this today, just take a look. And, and if you're wondering whether or not you should try these patches or not, I just want you to look at yourself and ask yourself, are you really happy? Are you really living a life full of joy? And if the answer is not 100% easily yes, then, you know, how can you shift that? What can you do? You know, look for solutions. Well, we have one solution right here for you. So, so activating the stem cells. And when you put this patch on the first time you put it on, within 24 hours, did you know you have reset 4,000 genes? Wow. Wow. Right? That's I mean, crazy. I was explaining to the guy I patched yesterday um, because he has issues about water. That's one thing that, you know, I, I make sure to tell people drink your water. So I was talking to him this morning. He's like, I think I can do this. I said, well, the only thing you have to do is put the patch on and drink your water. He's like, oh, water. Yeah. I said, okay, it's like this. You plant a garden and in that you got little plants that need to grow. Your plants are not going to grow if you do not water them. So your stem cells are like little plants and you need to water them so they can go out and fight the fight that you need to fight. I was like, that. oh, I could do that. <laughs> Easy. I know. I'm, I'm going to steal that, Katana. I really like that. And, you know, I um, recently, yeah. water is, I, I, I've always been about water. You know, I was a massage therapist for many, many years, told my clients, you know, drink half your body weight in water um, a day just to hydrate. 
and um, I kind of fell off the wagon a couple of months ago, and I ended up getting a severe dehydration to the point <clears throat> where I would wake up dizzy. Um, and so I started to drink some Pedialyte and a friend of mine who also was battling drinking water. It's not that I don't like water. I love water, but you know, we don't take care of ourselves and we don't do what we should all the time. But what it turned out wasn't that I wasn't drinking enough water. I was, it was just flushing. My body was unable to absorb the water. Mm. And so, um, when that happened, I started to drink the Pedialyte, which of course is full of Sugar dyes water. and stuff and all that good stuff. And I was on a call, um, a LifeWave call with um, our team. And somebody said, messaged me and said, Sheila, you need to look into a company called LMNT. LMNT. And um, they take electrolytes of sodium, potassium, and magnesium in the water or in this little package. Write that down. Salt. It's salt. And you dump it in your bottles of water. And my favorite is watermelon flavor. That's what I'm drinking right now. Watermelon flavored salt water. <laughs> wow. And I'll tell you what, my, again, my life has shifted and I know that, um, that my, the copper that I'm taking is now being able to be absorbed into my body. The water I drink every day is being absorbed. And so many times when we are drinking the water, it's just flushing out our bodies because we don't have the proper electrolytes and, and salts in our system. And so now I am recommending to people to, you know, whether you go with this company or not, I know there's plenty of them out there now, but LMNT, it's all organic. And, Is it mlnt.com.org? Uh, drink, drink. L M N T. Oh, okay. But, and also I wanted to mention that the copper that we're taking is actually copper glycinate. So that okay. synthesizes better with the cells. This, because we know this because our wonderful inventor, CEO of LifeWave is speaking live to all of us and he's explaining good things. Magnesium glycinate, that's really good too. And he said to take that in the evening, right? I believe so. Yes. I think that's to calm the body. And we also have other things like the, the shine, right? We were talking before and we all use this shine. Yes. Yeah. You know, I have, I was interviewing um, a gentleman for the podcast a couple of months ago and um, his name is Steve and he's 74 and I've known, I've known Steve since, pretty much my joining life wave he's um oh and there's shine right there and um yeah. we we were both at convention last year and and we were you know if you went to convention last year you were gifted the pair of shine and dream yeah. and one of the things that uh, david schmidt talked about on the stage was that when they were doing the different um uh, target group testing and stuff David decided to be one of the subjects on this and uh, what it, what one of the side effects or benefits is that it increases testosterone okay <laughs> and love life <laughs> and, and so I interviewed Steve and funnily enough Steve had gone through because you'll find a lot of people in LifeWave are going out and getting these age biological blood testing done to see what where they are biologically aged and um his when he he had finished the he went to the convention he used the bottle so that's one month cuz that spray lasts one month yeah and um 40 bucks his Testosterone had increased by 200 points. 200 points? Wow. 200 points, okay? And men don't, you know, in our food supply, in, in the food that we are, are being Consuming. and that's produced, you know, it's it doesn't have all the nutrients like we used to get in them because of soil leaching and the, 
the pesticides, et cetera, et cetera. We don't need to go into that, but but it does. Men are having less testosterone. You know, I mean, if you consume a huge amount of soy, that that's a problem too. So now with this uh, mist and um, that Katana is sharing, I mean, wow. You guys have to get it. The link is below. We'll show you how to get it. You guys have to get it. But also it helps women's hormones also. So if you're having hot flashes, if you're looking for a way out, don't look for synthetic drugs. Don't look for pills. We literally have the best product on this planet. We really do. It's a sticker and then and then you smell it. Well, how hard is that? Forty dollars and the sticker is three dollars <laughs> and thirty three cents a day. I think everybody can afford that, right? That's right. That's Come on. Right. Don't be cheap. Well, you know what? Well, it's you have to value your life. What value level do you put on your health? Okay. I wish I had known some of the things today that I, 10 years ago that I, you know, so that I could have been not so far behind the curve and catching up on my health and healing, because that's where, where we're at, you know, and it, it takes, um, just, this has just been bandied about, but one month for each decade that you've been alive, wearing the patch to get you to, um, a higher frequency where, you know, where you are totally, you're, well, we have people in our team that are in their eighties and they are registered as biologically 35 years old. Okay. All right. I want to be that way. All right. Raise your hand. If you want to be 35 at 60. I feel like I'm 35. I'm 54. My age is actually 54, but I feel like I'm 35 and I'm like I really want to do the test to see where I am biologically I've been kicking it around and I'm thinking that I I I don't know why but I want to do it in 2024 I don't know why but that's where I want to where I want to do it at so well I can't wait until I'm 150 I can't wait till I'm 150 and I'm going to be with all of you guys. And then we're still going to do this. And they remember <laughs> back in 2023, <laughs> let me call. show you the video. <laughs> exactly. Because I mean, what do we all want? Mm-hmm. You know, I'm, I, I'll be turning 60. I've got two kids, seven grandkids and two great grandkids. Now, I want to see those great grandkids graduate from high school. I want to be there when they graduate from college. All right. So let's say college, that gives them 21, 22 years. I'll be in my 80s. I want to be vital, energetic, and full of joy. I don't want to be on the couch in a ball in depressed. pain. Depressed. Right. Your body hurts, crumbled up. And I mean, watching Vanna walk. Or as, <laughs> as my friend says, uh, or be in a nursing home, you know, with all the other people, it, you know, it's, a, it's your, they put you in a little box, give you a TV and tell you have a nice day. And it's funny because my youngest son, I asked him, I said, what are you going to do when I get old? He's like, mom, I'll put you in front of a TV and feed you. And I don't want you to say anything from that point. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, I, I tell him that. <laughs> <laughs> so I, what I tell him, that was my youngest son. So my oldest son, I'm like, hey, you know, you're 35. You know, you're starting to lose those stem cells. He's like, I am God, and I do not accept all of this. And I said, that's okay. I'm going to be passing you the other way. (laughs) So you'll be older, and I'll be younger. (laughs) You know, um, the question has been raised. So our friend Kathleen, her daughter is 17. She'll be 18 in two or three months. And 
people say, well, why is she on the patch? Okay. Well, when Sienna and I were patched the exact same day, oh, wow. when she was um, 15 and um, 15 and a half or 14 and a half, something like that. Anyway, she had had this summer of darkness and um, her friend had passed away. She'd had some really big, huge traumas before they moved here to Hawaii. And she, the night before Sienna was patched, she was, wrote a suicide note. And um, she was very dark and withdrawn from life and angry at everybody and wouldn't shower. And just this, this girl who was this beautiful child when she moved here, she got patched three and a half weeks later. It's um, uh, the 26th of December boxing day in our family. Cause my husband's British and um, Kathleen calls me from Oregon and she's bawling. And I'm like, Oh my gosh, is everything okay? And she says, well, Sienna has been dancing and singing and she came running to me, grabbed my hands and says, mama, I finally feel like I'm me again. Oh. Well, this girl has gotten, um, it's a half ride scholarship to the second um, largest dance school in the United States. She graduated May 20th um, and she's going to New York, Manhattan in October to go to school. And people say, well, why do you put kids on patches? That's why we put kids on patches. That is why we patch them. And what was she using? The Nirvana or Next um, You know what? When we got started, it was just X39. Right. And we did not, uh, we went, that was 2019, November. We went into 2020. We got locked down really quickly. And so the second patch that uh, Kathleen, Sienna, and my husband and I, we all decided that we were going to start was glutathione yeah. so that we could elevate our immune system. So 100% that X39 did its job. And uh, when I went to that convention in January, that was when we came out with the brain mapping study. And at six weeks, what happens is your brain, six weeks of wearing the X39 patch, your brain hemispheres are balanced. And that's what was happened to Sienna. Her brain started communicating again, right? So at six weeks, we're talking about PTSD, anxiety, and depression are being alleviated or maybe alleviated within the body maybe. at two months, our cardiovascular system is reverse aging. And at three months, that's where the collagen is kicking in, um, which is strengthening our muscles, our bones, our skin is getting less wrinkly, looking better. <laughs> Look at that, right? We all get up yeah, here. Like, hello, <laughs> I'm 52. <laughs> and you guys don't look in your 50s. So um, we're in great company here. But um, so why would we want to patch a teenager so that they don't have to go through that? You know, yeah, they're going to go through the mental traumas and the physical traumas and everything like we always do. And we all grew up. Right. But, you know, I'm a girl that drank water from a hose and it didn't kill me. Okay. But today I don't think now I it's different. water from a hose. <laughs> now, now it's different. different. Did, now it's different. We don't drink have... water from a hose today. No, don't. <laughs> we have plastics in our water right now. Just to let, please don't, because we do have. That is correct. And, but why shouldn't we give these kids the opportunity to keep their stem cells at 35 and continue to produce them versus producing half of them. Okay. I mean, isn't it a little greedy if we're not going to share with everybody? Absolutely. You know, um, I Absolutely. want my kids to be healthy. I want them to be happy and whole. And um, you can't force anybody to wear a patch. Okay, you can't. No. And, um, you can't. I, I don't know that we talked about that. There's nothing that comes out of this patch and goes into your body. Not a thing. It's right. all phototherapy. And when your body heat hits this patch, it acts like a reflective surface. It's a, it turns into this little lattice and, and it literally mirrors your energy back to you. So if I'm not going to put a drug in my body, I wouldn't put a drug in my kid's body. 
if I'm going to help myself, why wouldn't I help them with something that's non-transdermal, that's going to elevate their um, frequency and um, help them shift into a mood? Because frankly, the teenagers today, I wouldn't want to be a teenager in this world. Okay. I wouldn't want to be one. I'm, I'm grateful that I was 41 years ago, you know, so. I know it's very hard, especially <laughs> we have a lot of very confusing messages. messages that are coming about. And we, I mean, I have two boys and one's 20, one's 14. So, you know, I turned off his social media. He doesn't have social media. The older one, he's fine. He's, he's fine. I can Good see job, that Mama, turn fine. that off. That's a hard thing to do. They don't want to, they don't want to. But it's not up to them. It's up to me because it's I'm the boss. Bad. Okay. It's That's taking that power. No. Yeah, I'm the boss. No. And I'm responsible for them. Not for what, you know, right now it's just a little too much. But so we finally have a good technology and we also have, it's almost like, you know, the yin and the yang. You have the dark and the light. Then And we always have to have that balance. But I feel like this right now is really going to alleviate, right, a lot of things that we couldn't alleviate ourselves i personally think that learning is growing and that's what i always say please continue to learn please continue to grow you know this is actually a technology that is going to be like tissues and toilet paper and q-tips in people's homes so the quicker people jump on this try it for me i tried it i gave it to katana she's like yeah and i also have a friend rich my friend Rich from Lithuania, you should see what he looks like. I have a before and after, and he is a want. I mean, he's just. Funny. He's changed even since we did his interview. Oh, yeah. yeah, he has changed tremendously Gosh. in a few months. Wait, it's actually gonna show it's you. amazing. Can I show to you really watch quick. It? I'm gonna share screen. See? Wow. 73 wow right this is when he first started and now he's you know so much better i just had to share because that's amazing isn't it it's, yeah. it's just it feels it's real my, it's real it's real oh it's, it's finally here <laughs> you know i i uh kathleen and i we work at the swap meet uh, well i i saw my dragon she she has a booth with it's just life wave and we met a person the other day and um and he says oh they don't work and and she says oh really why do you say that and he says well because i tried it for one week <laughs> and <laughs> she and i both i mean she threw her head back and let this huge laugh out and <laughs> uh, and i'm like looking at her like um you might have hurt his feelings but you know she's like sir this is cellular healing this isn't a cut on your finger. This is going in. It's resetting your genes. It is helping mend broken DNA. It is lengthening the telomeres. And, uh, you know, all of these different things that most of us have never even heard about. And we don't care about it. And, and honestly, if I wasn't so into the patches and everything, I, you know, it's not research that I necessarily would have gotten into myself. However, I like to learn and I do like, I'm always looking for ways that can help me personally raise my frequency because that's all we are. We are just a big bag of frequency, you know? And the cells have energy. The brain has energy and we know that right? That's so right. we have to look at that when no one's telling us about that, right? Even That's though we're doing our cleansings and this and that, but still we're looking in cellular. And once again, it's for every 10 years, one month, you have to. I tell, yeah. We tell everybody it's a strict protocol. If you can't follow the protocol, then don't do it. But please, it's just, as, just like you have a telephone. You have to Plug in your telephone. It's a technology, right? This is another technology. Same thing. There's it's, rules. Well, and you know, 
one of the things um, that that I've recently told somebody is that just like what you said, it, you know, well, I just want to do it for one month and then see how I feel. And I've said, don't waste your money. Don't waste your money. If you cannot commit to a minimum of a three month program of this, don't waste your money. And and the thing is, it's not a huge quantity of money. It is in in you know. It's ninety nine ninety five a month, okay? For me, I am I am making that part of my life uh, important. I'm making it, my cellular healing important. Can I forego going down to Starbucks? There's not even one that I could. Coffee bean and tea leaf is my little store in the street. <laughs> But, you know, I can go down there and I can spend six fifty for a cup of coffee. And, and what's that doing to me? It's putting it's hydrating you. Fat. It's hydrating me with caffeine. It's and killing it's you. The sugars. It's terrible, right? It's terrible. It's um, putting fat on my butt. It's jacking up my sugar, your blood sugar, um, the cream dairy that clogs your system right so there comes a point in life where you have to decide to prioritize how your health is important or not and you know ladies we're in our 50s and today we can say it's important because we all want to live a long life my both my grandmothers were in their hundreds when they died okay so it's in my genes, and uh, by wearing the X39, I can um, elevate my genes to their fullest potential. And, you know, I plan on living to be at least 103. So I think we're going to go up to 500. You I know, just want to say that. That's what I think. But listen, let's see. Right. You know, isn't it uh, Methuselah? Wasn't he like 368 yeah. or something, something like that? Old as Methuselah. Um, so why, why shouldn't we be able to? Right. That's true. Think, what, what was they doing in that point in time to be able to live that, that long? They didn't have plastic in their water. Yeah. They didn't have fluoride in their water. Pretty sure that the Nile River was not fluoridated. How are you managing life with the possibility and the expansion of working with LifeWave? How are you handling that? Well, you know, I, I, I've i been doing it since 2019. When we got locked down, I kind of checked out of um, being an active brand partner and was just primarily using, that sounds terrible. I was a user. <laughs> uh, but I I worked, I took that 2020 and 2021 to work uh, and to get my master neuroenergetic certification. And then I came back to the realization that I'm having such huge shifting within my own being and physical healing um, and, and I just want to make it clear, this patch is not the healer. This patch is a tool that your body uses to facilitate your healing. And the healing comes within, all of that energy comes within. And so my primary mission, really, when I realized, you know, it's always been about helping people level up and frequency and elevating frequency, well... Here's a tool with a 20-year patent on it that is doing just that. And so I decided last year in April to really get back full full throttle into um, sharing and explaining about LifeWave and training people and teaching about the technology so that, um, that I'm walking my walk and talking my talk instead of just talking it. But... Um, you know, I'm a, I'm a teacher at heart of all things metaphysical and, um, that's, I just want to keep on sharing it and teaching people about how to use it. 
And I think you're having fun too, aren't you? <laughs> I am having fun. I am having fun. And you know what? What you know, people say, oh my gosh, this nine to five job, you know? Well, yeah, we've all had nine to five jobs, or most of us have had some nine to five jobs, but um this job uh, right now we're sitting in my office uh, however i could be out on the beach and i can be texting people and calling people and my office is the beach i can be working at the swap meet in my booth and my office is my booth so what i have done is not only given myself um health freedom i give myself time freedom and the ability to be my own boss and work from wherever I want to. I am not going in and clocking in anymore to an, you know, I, I was a massage therapist at a, at a chiropractic office for three years. Before that, um, my husband and I operated three McDonald's restaurants and I wrote schedules for 250 employees. So I've done it all. And being your own employer, your own boss, and having no employees, that is the sweet spot in life. And um, so financially, my time-wise, um, and my health, what more can you ask for for your own person? Because when you have that, that's when you can go out and have relationship in a positive way. And we can be community, and we can have fun with our family and our friends instead of we all get together and we go oh my god my bad cake's so bad today you know I don't want to hear it we're just professional complainers <laughs> that, that's I, it. Oh. I was just talking to uh one of the boarders and I asked her if she's coming out this week and she's like Oh, I, you know, I've done 39 hours and three days. And, and I'm like, okay, I don't want to hear that. I'm like, this is your choice of working what you did. Um, I gave you an option to opt out of that and opt into something that is flexible, easy, and you get to be free. And the other thing is we all could take our office to Aruba. We could... <laughs> Anywhere exactly. around the world. Anywhere. <laughs> yeah. Anywhere. You're not tied down anymore. So many people on our team who have left their nine to fives because of this, but they didn't, it wasn't their intent originally. You know, it was the intent of, oh, I, I see this tool. I need to use this tool for my health. Okay. And then once you start seeing these changes in yourself, you just can't help it because people come up to you and they go, what have you been doing, Sheila? You know, I mean, I graduated 42 years ago from high school. I have people that graduated with me that look 20 years older than me. Okay. Yeah. We've all had different life experiences, but that's, that's crazy to me why you would ever want to um, not give yourself the opportunity for something different. You know, why not, why not want to be able to sit at 1230 at my time and we are all having a conversation instead of me being running a restaurant, right? Or doing intense deep tissue body work on someone. Yeah. I mean, your life, your power, your choice. And that's why we're here yeah. to share this technology with people because we want to raise awareness. We, we understand that people don't really know what this is. And for us to have a platform, these beautiful three ladies together, raising this consciousness, learning more is very important to me especially, you know, thank you. And I know that you also do extra things. What do you do on the side? <laughs> <laughs> well, 
Well, so I, uh, Kathleen teases me because I say I have multiple passions and she's like, oh, life wave has to be your passion. I'm like, no, I, I have a passion and I create um, what's called Organite and I make dragon eggs and dragon babies and dragons and, um, and Organite, okay, uh, just since we're talking about frequency, it's all about frequency. And um, I was introduced to it in 2015. And what Organite does is that uh, when you have when you have resin, this is set in resin, and then you put quartz crystals. Quartz crystals have electricity like we do. They are piezoelectricity. That's what LCD, liquid crystal diode. Um, and when you put them under pressure in resin, they their um, electricity stays on permanently. And so you put crystals, quartz, and then metal into the resin. And what happens is dirty energy, EMF, um, nasty attitudes, it's all attracted to that resin. And then the positive sh um, uh, frequency from the crystals shifts that. And then the metal pushes clean energy out 24 hours a day. Mm -hmm. So that's why I started this was to um, help people raise their frequency, get get rid of the dirty energy around us, you know, because now we're at 5G, right? Which 5G means it's the fifth generation of microwave, which um, is just being constantly zapped at us. And so um, I have dragons and dragon eggs all literally in multiple countries around the planet. And one of my dreams is to, it was actually started by a couple down in um australia i think it was or new zealand and they they gift the world with organite and they just will go out into like by electrical towers military installations and they drop pieces of organite and yes i can say i've done that all over alaska and here in hawaii as well <laughs> So that's my other passion. And thank you for asking me, Patty. Oh, yes. I want to share your creations because you are a beautiful creator, just like all of us. We all create something, right? And your creations are very important because you are protecting the human body and also the world. And I appreciate that, definitely. And we'll put down a link with your information if you would like. Thank you. I'd appreciate that very much. Yes. And how much are they? So uh, an egg this size is $47. And if you're here, you don't pay shipping. But if you're, <laughs> you're not on island, then it I think it's like $5.50 to ship. Oh, it's not bad. That. No, it's not bad at all. But um, and and I, you can order on my website. Um, I do make dragons that um, like a special order dragons for you. And you were yeah. showing us one. What does that look yeah. like? That little baby. Let me see if I can grab that. Oh, up. that was on your phone. I'm sorry. It's okay. No worries. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful dragon. Okay. So here's the baby. And that's Amethyst and Citrine. And he sits and they sit in a little wood nest that I make him. And yes, he has a praying mantis on his head. And it was amazing. I have a video and this little mantis is dancing on top of the dragon baby. That was really cool. <laughs> and then, um, and I don't know that you got to see this one, Patty. I showed Katana. This is as big as my hand. And that's water, uh, that's tourmaline, pink tourmaline, rose quartz, moonstone, Tibetan quartz eyes. And that's my dragon heads. And they, they retail out for 200 and then shipping is about 20 for them. Thank you very so much you can, for that. Absolutely. You can find your own dragon now. So. Yeah. Come on, guys. Give her a call. You need to have this. It's a very good thing for your home. Absolutely. And I'm going to get one. So that's cool. <laughs> Yeah. But I yes. want this to be white. All white. Oh, moonstone and pearl. I already see that. Mm -hmm. divine right? <laughs> divine uh, feminine yeah um i appreciate you coming uh the one thing i uh, was thinking about when you was talking about 
when we don't realize how how good we could feel. It made me think about when I would go to the chiropractor, and he was uh, very good about finding blocked energies. And this is one thing that um, these patches do assist with, is opening up those blocked energy passageways. And so I would lay on his table, and I, we don't realize sometimes how much pain that we are in because we get used to it. And so he'd lay me out, and he would take two fingers and barely push on my hips, and I would just cry. And I'm like, why are you putting me in so much pain? He goes, honey, this is what you walk around with every day. Wow. wow. And I said, no, I didn't wow. have that before I got here. <laughs> he says, yes, you do. Wow. So the thing is that to understand, you might not realize how much pain that you are in every day that you're carrying because you have some blocked energy fields. And as Miss Sheila said, we are light bodies and we move that energy out with these patches and bring that light into the body because this is what we truly are, is this light body. And to bring that happiness to the heart, you have to bring that light to the heart and enjoy, enjoy life. Thank you. One of the things too, when you said, I don't walk around with that pain every day because he touched you and he brought you into your body to the awareness of that pain. And what many of us that are um, uh, chronic pain li livers, right? We live in that chronic pain cycle. Um, I'm going to say past, I past lived in it. I don't live in that anymore, but I would check out and my soul would pull up out of my body and I would be like a robot going through my day. But my soul is up here because the pain was so bad and I couldn't take the, the painkillers. And so we numb ourselves mentally and physically to try to deal with what we're experiencing. And when you can um, get out of that pain cycle and you come back into your body, your life shifts and you can live life to the fullest that a human can live it. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. 100%. In the body. In the body. In the body. <laughs> In the body. And that's why we're here, right? We we came to this planet to have a human experience. Okay, Absolutely. we all have whatever soul job or whatever we're doing. You know, each one is unique, but we all collectively came as humans. So yeah. So why do we have a human body and we're up here hanging out while the human body is just like you know walking around going oh. oh. I got to go to work today. This is great. And you're not really happy. And to shift the planet, to shift the people on the planet, because Mother Earth has risen to a higher level of vibration. And she's like, come on, children. I used to tell people, beep, beep, get on the bus. It's time to go. We're leaving. And... um you're going to get left behind and you'll be down there and I'll be up here. But I would love for you to come with us. I would love for you to be a part of that light. I would love to see that happiness and that joy and that your that freedom that you deserve. Yes, absolutely. Amen to that. Amen. Namaste. Amen. All those good feelings. That's all right. Thank you. Thank you so much for all of this, you guys. It's been an honor, Sheila. Katana, you look amazing. Katana has so many success stories herself. And we definitely hope that everybody enjoys this show tonight, today, this afternoon, whatever you're watching it. But uh, 
Go with your life and be happy. Don't forget to play. This is what I tell everybody. Please don't forget to play. And this is just a way for you to wake up a little more with this information. Well, thank you ladies for inviting me. It's been a pleasure and, and huge. I've really enjoyed this. So thank you. we need to talk more. Yeah. <laughs> yes. We're going to say goodbye for now. And thank you very much, you guys. Bye-bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye-bye.